got good news. Our new shirt's arrived, but there's something else. I've got a new toy, but my wife says I have to keep it outside. I'll show you in a minute. It is a sunny day in late November and I'm gonna start doing up some Christmas lights um, I actually bought a few more today oops my bad <laughs> um, so yeah we're gonna start setting up the Christmas lights and we'll put this on time-lapse and uh, share it with you <laughs> Okay, it's starting to get a little bit dark here, so I'm gonna have to abort on the uh, GoPro. Um, we lose the sunlight so early now. Um, Maddie and Wrigley are getting a little annoyed with me because I won't let them play. They have to stay tied up or else they'll just be running all the neighborhood. As it is, they're digging, Maddie. Stop digging. Are you trying to wrap yourself around the tree like mom did the Christmas lights? Huh? Okay, so this is the plan. I'm going to run these icicle lights from the top of the trailer over to that tree there so that the car can park underneath it. And then I've got these nice little silver balls that I just picked up. Got six of those. I got four silver. Oops, that one's kind of more gold. So I'm going to hang those intermittently along the lights. And then I've got these bigger lights which I'm gonna get up into that tree up there and then run it over to meet the one pile of lights that are just lying on the ground that is the plan <laughs> let's see if we can how much we can get done oh and then I have this thing my little strobe thing it has snowflakes on it I haven't decided where to sort of straight position that I'm thinking so it can go up into the trees maybe beside the little uh my deer <laughs> so I'm gonna when it gets a little darker I'm gonna plug it in and see where uh where it can go best so that we won't have to use any of the trailer light anyways I'm gonna go and find uh the stepladder and uh see if we can get some stuff hung up Here we are at the back of the truck. We are daring to dream. We're official. <laughs> Got the new stickers in the other day too. Anyways, that's not the important part. This is my new toy. Champion Digital Hybrid 4000 Watt Inverter Generator. It's my new toy and I'll show you how to work it in a little bit. So over the last month, they started putting up all these Christmas decorations. Every day there was a couple more items on the the uh, that would pop up and so I think they've run out of things to put up. So we've got snowmen and everything lights up too. There's a little train right there and candy canes, and lights in the tree. It's daylight so I thought I would just show you some of the work that they've done. So all in front of the office is a variety of different characters. Beautiful uh, unicorns with their pink manes and tails. And we have like all kinds of 
And when this lights up at night, it's really quite something. And then there's some snowflakes up there. And I'll go a little closer when we come back. Um, we'll, uh, oh, and here's another snowman. And Snoopy! <laughs> We're gonna start out here at the front of the park. So as you drive in, you see a couple of deers on the edge and some trees and everything's tied down so it doesn't blow away when we get some of these wind storms we get De December and January. Um, and then we have some snowmen and some more deer and a moose. And I thought they were done putting up decorations. But today we have this elephant that they're just securing down to the ground. So when you drive in the park at night, you end up seeing all these beautiful lights. So that the guys, and they said that barn's not empty yet. Okay, and we got Santa on a snow bit on a uh, quad here. I think my neighbor, old neighbor had one of those. So there's all kinds of inflatables, accessories to light up. And Snoopy in his plane. That one's awesome. Can't imagine what their hydro bell is going to look like. Uh, so I did a little bit of decorating in our site. Just put up some lights and whatnot. Um, but it's nothing like this. So this is uh, along the garden, outside the uh, pool. And then as you drive in, all kinds of characters. Cookie Monster, Big Bird, another Snoopy. I think they have a handful of Snoopies here. And then all these lights on the side of the building. Um, they light up. And oh, the peacocks are new. They weren't there the other day. So, and then all these giant light bulbs. Wrigley, no, you can't go in there. <laughs> I think she sees a squirrel or something. So, and then we have a, a blow up um, nativity scene. Yeah, so I'll bring you back at night when it's all lit up. Um, and I can't even believe that they're still adding to it. There's just no more space up here. So our na the neighbors are getting into decorating their sites and stuff too. So we have these guys and they had music playing last night when I walked by. So they got some inflatables as well. So and these people have a nice little arrangement with every day somebody's adding a little bit something. I'm sure after this weekend we'll have quite a few uh, lights and decorations. So those are all very nice. So this is the new generator we got. Uh, these are the few accessories that come with it. A little 12 volt DC jumper and I probably won't ever use those because I have a, a small uh, Viera as well that does the same job. That's a good good little deal. This here is a 30 amp locking adapter so we can plug a 30 amp RV straight into it. We have a 50 amp unit but we've got dog bones and when you need power 30 is better than nothing. Also, it comes with a couple of USB adapters for the 12 volt outlet. Pretty good little unit. The reason we went with this one is basically it's 86 pounds compared to the one I was comparing it to, 212 pounds. I was looking at the 9,000 watt because you can plug a 50 amp directly into it. 212 pounds, I can move around fairly easily right now. But in three, four, five years, that's gonna be a tank. This little guy, 86 pounds, with no fuel, of course, but uh, it only has, I think, about a two gallon tank, which is another 10, 15 pounds, not a big deal. And uh, also, it fits in the truck below the level of the box top, so I can put a tonneau cover on instead of having to go out and get a canopy. This little guy, I broke it in once already, just a couple days ago, I ran it for three hours, and then another two, 
five hours is the recommended break-in time. Took it out of the box, put the oil in, followed the instructions, it's just 10 easy steps. Second pull on the cord, fired up right away. No problem at all. So now that I've shown you how easy it is to just take it out of the box, just the easy steps, they give you uh, pictures and well, words as well to describe exactly what to do when you take it out of the box. And it's so easy to get it out of the box, fire it up, and after the five hour break in time, you're supposed to change the oil again. It only takes just over a half a liter or half a quart of oil and uh, you're good to go. So I'm going to fire it up now to show you how easy it is. All we have to do is turn on the fuel right here, push the on button, one pull, two, oh, forgot to choke, my bad. <laughs> runs at 64 decibels. Uh, I don't know if anybody's had a generator before that's louder. I think I'll move a little closer. Anyway, this one is an open frame generator. It runs at 64 decibels. Uh, most of the ones I was comparing it to ran 68 to 78 decibels. But when you have no power, I don't think it matters how loud the unit is. As long as it can keep you warm, keep the lights on, and uh, keep the fridge working. We're all good. Day one. Okay, so it's dark, but we want to show you around the uh, park uh, some of the Christmas lights that have been put up. Uh, some of the the main entrance to the park is really quite something. So. Um, they really well, go all out every year. Yeah, apparently. it's and apparently, according to the ladies at the front, the owners of the park buy something new every year. Yeah, so we'll start with ours. Back of our trailer, we have a little light, little tree all lit up, and we have some blinky lights on the back with some garland, which you can't quite see. Inside, there's some little lights. So we'll show you inside later. I haven't finished in there. So and then we have our paw lights. And then we have our icicle lights all along there. And then if you come to the front of our site, past the truck, we've got some more blinky lights on the trees, I'm falling over the roots. And just along, and then right across the front, that was a bit of a trick trying to get the uh, lights high enough without anything in the middle to uh, support them. <laughs> little bit of a trick so and then we got some going right there to the trailer and of course my little reindeer i think i'd like to go find some more reindeer to add to the collection he's look a looking a little lonely okay so as you come in through the main entrance um towards the site we have this lovely display And then, along here, a little choo-choo train. All the lights, a wreath on the fence. And then, come over and in front of the office, we got some lovely displays. They've really gone all out on the decor. We even got Paw Patrol ready to deliver presents. Sorry, I don't know the lingo for Paw Patrol for all you little ones out there. As you pull into the park, the gates have um, blue lights attached to them. There's Brent and Wrigley. And the brand new sign. And the brand new sign. So then we got some lights in the trees here. We got some trees and some reindeer. 
And then we have all of these guys along the edge here. Who knows, we're probably doing this tonight and they might even stick more stuff up tomorrow. And then we have pretty candles all along the driveway. In the snow family. And then we have, this, the elephant does have his own light, but it's not very bright. Spotlight. Yeah. There's a car coming. <laughs> We have our resident moose. And there's the Russian Santa family. What do they call those things, Brett? Uh, can't think about <laughs> but it's from Russia, right? Yes. Yeah, Santa on a quad. We got snow, the trees. Oh, the tree has lights, but it's very dim. <laughs> it's all right. Penguin. We got Snoopy, Infl another inflatable. So we got the lights on the trees, all kinds of ho-ho-hos. We got another Santa. So is that one, two, three blow-up Santas in the main area. Tree lit all the way up. And our lighthouse has got some wreaths on it. Okay, now we come back to the office. So they go all out and then we have all these wonderful little neon lights against the building. I'll have to get a little closer so you can see it. Oh, even a dinosaur. <laughs> a dinosaur? Maddie, you're gonna get run over dog. And the penguins. And we got the penguins in a balloon. Oh the neon. Wow, yeah. And then we got some peacocks. Snoopy on his hog. Yeah, there's Snoopy on his on his Harley. <laughs> or snowflake mobile. You don't need your he headlamp, Brent. Yeah, I know. I turned it off. <laughs> <It's better. laughs> okay. Let's carry on down this way. I don't know. He doesn't really talk. I want some of these big Christmas lights. And in the back there, we have a nativity scene. Brent was wondering the name of uh, Snoopy's little friend. I'm pretty sure it is Woodstock.
I just wanted to show you briefly what I've done with the interior of our trailer. Um, we showed all the outside decorations and what they had done there. Um, so I've got uh, a lot of Christmas decor inside of a small space. Um, I don't think it looks too cluttered. Yeah, here and there. Okay, let's have a look. So, got a new Christmas mug. Just, just leave it till tomorrow. Okay, well, no, nice little box. decorative vase. Got some this colorful is. snowflakes in the window. I got your Santa hat. Got some bows and a gigantic <laughs> star. Bought that one at IKEA a few years ago. Works great on a lamp. I had to try and. <laughs> Jimmy it so I found some little battery operated lights. That's very cute. All our stockings, Maddie's yeah. and Wrigley's and I mine and Brent's are ready to go there. for Santa to come. And then our little <laughs> tiny Christmas tree which Flip. sits right nicely Don't on the uh, side or end table. And then I put well, I you have a job to do. Do it. I put uh, Christmas days. lights it's all nice along day. the edge of the the um, <laughs> slide underneath the island. I put some lights. I had some snowflakes hanging there but Wrigley kept hitting them with her tail so I had to take them down. So that is what we've done on the inside of our trailer. So um, Merry Christmas and we will talk to you soon. Bye.